Hey guys, got a quick uh, kind of initial impressions and I'm gonna talk about the performance of the Cloud Defensive Rain 2. First, the Modlite PLH V2. I've only had this Rain 2 for about two weeks. It's only been out for a month or so. So I haven't had a lot of time with it and I'm gonna leave the details and intricacies of it for uh, people with much more experience than I do. But first off, just showing the size difference. It's very similar. The Modlite is also an 18650 with the DS, I believe, 00, zero tail cap, which provides you with both the clicky tail cap as well as the ability to use a Surefire plug. If you use a Modlite with a UE tail cap, the Modlite is smaller. However, some of that size difference is kind of negated by the fact that the cable comes out the back of the UE versus out the side for the Surefire. Now, my real goal in making this video is to try to, to, try to show some of the differences in performance. However, I have a difficult time capturing on video how it looked to the eye based on all the metering and fancy stuff that the uh, camera does. So some of this you have to take, your, take my word for it, but uh, comparing them at distances of 60 out to about 150 yards, they performed very similarly. The biggest difference is the uh, temperature with the mod light having a much cooler temperature, meaning the light is blue uh, or almost blue to very, um, very white, while the rain has a warmer yellow type, uh, type glow to it. As far as how they performed, I did not notice a significant difference. I expected the PLHP2 to have more flood based on the fact that it's got more lumens, and I expected the rain 2 to have more uh, throw based on the fact that it's got about 20,000 more cantella. However, distances out to 150 yards, I really couldn't tell a difference. I had my wife step out to see if she could tell a difference. She could care less about Cloud Defensive or Mod Light, she said that she thought they looked very similar upon first turning it on. Now, the big difference that I noticed is that as I left them on, after about two to three minutes, the difference became pronounced and that the Mod Light was outperforming the rain. And after about five minutes, that difference became very significant. I started with both full batteries in each, factory batteries, tried to remove any, um, any variables that I could. And I'm gonna cut in some pictures this is uh, looking at a barn 60 yards away. The rain is on the left. The PLHV2 is on the right. And then after five minutes, the second photo, you can really see that the mod light PLHV2 on the right is performing much better than the rain 2 on the left. They've been left on for five minutes. They're in the same position relative to the barn and both have fresh batteries. Guys, I didn't notice this difference as much at closer distances. Whenever I was shining at something farther away, uh, 50 yards and out, I very much noticed a difference in performance. I'm curious to hear if others have had the same experience or if I got a lemon. Uh, I'd love to know if you have experience. If you have both these lights, try them out there. Let me know in the comments if you've had the same experience. Otherwise, guys, uh, both great lights. I do like how the Cloud Defensive's um, cable comes out the side. Much better for cable management. However, in that same vein, the Mod Light allows you to use Surefire plugs. So if you've got those sitting around at home or want to use something like a Unity Taps where you have both a light and laser slaves to the same um, pressure pad, you can only do that with the Mod Light. Otherwise, um, you know, very similar. The price is pretty similar right now, about 380 from Cloud Defensive, 395 for the PLHV2, the body, the DS00 tail cap, and the Mod Button Light from uh, Rooftop Defense with code Lumens, which has been the same price for about a year now. I would expect the Cloud Defensive will become cheaper as time goes on. They also have their uh, program where you can trade in an old light for $100 credit to get um, a Rain or a Rain 2. So overall, the Rain does appear to be the better value. However, that degradation of performance over time as they're both left on absolutely gives the Mod Light a heads up, in my opinion. Try to be as unbiased as possible. And uh, if you've experienced differently, I'd love to hear about it. But for me, the Mod Light PLHV2 is still the king, even though I honestly went in this thinking that the Rain 2 would outperform it. Thanks for watching, guys. Y'all have a great day.